All right, here's what I'll call the bottom retention overhand shuffle. Before you learn how to do this, you should be able to do just your standard overhand shuffle. So you can check the link in the description box for that. Uh, what this is, is a way to maintain the bottom card of the deck while doing an overhand shuffle. So for example, I have the three of spades here. I can give the deck uh, a shuffle, and I can do this as long as I want, but that three of spades will always remain on the bottom. Okay, So this is incredibly easy to do. It really is just the perfect move. It looks exactly like a normal overhand shuffle. It really is a normal overhand shuffle with just one key difference, and that is that I'm laying these three fingers on the face of uh, the deck, and I'm applying just a little bit of pressure so that when I remove this bottom, that initial packet, that card is just being dragged. It's being left behind. Okay? So that's what's happening. Okay, of course, it happens at this angle, though. Okay, so you can see it like this. There's really no explanation necessary here. It'll take like two minutes for you to learn. Okay, so just hold that bottom card back as you remove that first packet and then continue on with the rest of the shuffle. I use this all the time. It's it's a great way to uh, maintain the bottom card. And of course, if you want to maintain the top card of the deck, just flip the pack over and do it face up. And that way, you know, you can preserve the top card of the deck. Okay, so that's uh, that's the first overhand shuffle technique for you. Take care.